WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down four, Nasdaq up 166, S and P's up 32. Gold, gold contract down a buck 40, trade to 2,358 an ounce. We have silver up seven cents, thirty dollars 53 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck and a half, 23.58 an ounce. A barrel rather. Notes and bonds, ten-year note up one tick, trading 108.24. The 30 up four at 116.30 and King dollar. King dollar is the move out here, folks. Try to well it did get back into its larger range. Uh, yesterday and overnight, and guess what? Gave it up in spades. Down 379, 104, 729, Euro 108, Yen 156, British pound 127 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the SPY. We're going to put these babies on weeklies now because uh, three day weekend and see what we look like on the weeklies here. So, on the weeklies, bottom line, you're going to be at highs, man. Yeah, you get a contraction of volume, but you're going to be over your high. Anything over the 524, 60 on the SPY, that's all you're at highs, period. You know, daily, weekly, monthly, all of the above. We take a look at the uh, three Qs. They're up $4.18 right now, and this one definitely is way over its high. And the volumes, the volume's not bad for a weekly, man. Well, let's see this for a second. One second. So, yeah, I know it actually is bad. 255. Yeah, it's real bad. 255 versus 134 right now. Last week was 169. So, that's saying this thing's going to, you know, next week would be a good week, little pullback happening. Because now what you have from that pullback that we had five weeks ago, that's a high volume low, man. That's going to get hit. And what's going to give the market breathing room, though, here we go, is the good old U.S. dollar. Because we take a look at the dollar, and, you know, bottom line, we got to 105, 119, and then it failed. You know, so we'll see if this battle's been going on for quite some time. But what has happened with the dollar, it first broke with conviction on the 3rd of May, broke with conviction again on the 15th of May. So we'll see how the whole thing shakes out. Gold, I with the well here. Yeah. I wish the gold market did what the note and bond market did. What happened with the note and bond market is that we had come down with volume. Note and bond market this morning got below it, rejected lower price, and wants higher price now. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.